Hey everyone, it's Relic here, and we are back playing some more Voxel Craft on the Voxel Squad server, sponsored by Sticky Pistons. So, it's been a few days since we last did an episode on Voxel Craft, and obviously, if you've been watching any of my other series, you know there's a lot going on at the moment. So, once again, apologies for that, but we are going to crack straight on today. So, I've not really done anything, I've kind of since the end of the last episode, this wall kind of needs finishing, but I'm not going to do that right now. The first thing that I want to do, because in between episodes, the only thing that I did do was a spot more mining. And I now kind of want to ditch this mine down here and I want to move into the mining dimension. Now there is a nether portal, uh, sorry, nether portal. There is a mining portal over in spawn, but Really, who wants to walk 284 blocks when I could just make one pretty easily and just dump it out here somewhere? So that is the first thing that we're going to do. Now, thankfully, it looks pretty easy. If I just go in and type in aroma, pretty much all you need is some stone and then a lot of stone and a bit of flint to make this. I think we just need some more of this, just some more normal sticks or whatever. And if I remember rightly, this is the same dimensions as a nether portal. Well, we're about to find out anyway. So we are going to need to make, I think if my maths are serving me correctly here, kind of 12 of these bricks potentially. Yeah, we'll go with half for now. So let's get a few of these bits and pieces made. So I say, first of all, we are going to need to make a load of bricks. Now we haven't actually got an awful lot of stuff here. And I think if I remember rightly in the last episode, I was moaning because I didn't have any cobble and it may well be loads of hardened stone, but unfortunately no cobble at the second. So let me just go and grab some of that really quickly. Okay. So a little bit of digging later and I'm quite sure what that was. I've, uh, I've managed to grab a load more cobble, so I've smelted a load of that down already and turned some of that into the stone bricks that we need. And I found a bunch more iron as well, so that is that's quite handy as well. So we are going to definitely be using that at some point pretty soon. So let's just remind ourselves what we need. So we need 30 bricks, which we've got, and we also need for each one of these we need this mining tool. Now, do you know what? I'm thinking to myself, actually, I might have miscounted because I think we only actually need the one mining tool. So let's grab some sticks from in here, make ourselves a pickaxe. And where did all of the cobble that I've just made go? That was really weird. I just, I've just gathered up a load of cobble and it seems to all be stone. I don't really get that. Okay, well, let's just... That was really weird. It's it's kind of, although it's sort of auto smell on it or something. I don't know. Maybe I've just put it away in a chest somewhere, have I, and, and not realised that I did it. I don't lose my mind already. So anyway, we need... Oh, there it is. That was really weird, because I thought that, that was stone. I'm going to have to look back on the video for that, but that looked like it was actually stone. So we've got a load of the flint that we need and we just need to make one flint and steel. So let's quickly throw that together and we need some more sticks as well. So let's just grab some sticks. Cool. And now we should have what we need to put this together. So there is the mining tool and then we can grab, I think let's just go with 20 of these and there we go weirdly that has just disappeared as well did that really use all of those okay well let's make another one of those as well there seems to be some pretty odd things going on today so we just in fact if we just throw all of that in there for now and we can grab that a bit later that is really the weirdest thing i just things just seem to be randomly disappear into there. I didn't realize maybe it's only got 20. Maybe it only has 20 goes before it runs out, but that's fine. So we need to put one of those together. Good. We need to put one of those together. And certainly not like that. Was that 
Ah, it needs to be a full. It needs to be a full one, doesn't it? Oh dear, all sorts, all sorts of chaos is breaking out right now. And now we are going to need to grab another stick. And there we go. Cool, right, let's grab the multi-tool then. And that really didn't want to go in there, did it? Right, there we go. So there is the multi-tool. And for now, I am just going to pop it over here. So as I say, we have got access to this whenever we need it. And we'll just dig it down one block so that we can just walk into it. So that's four blocks down there, like so. One, two, three, four. And it's one, two, three, four, five. I lost the ability to speak then. That's a bit worrying. And that down there. Can we get onto the wall? Good. Safe just taking any damage. And I didn't want to put that there. It's fine. Let's just mine that off again. This will probably be super hard to mine now. Okay, it's not. Cool. Right. And I think we just give it a tap with the tool. Excellent. Right. So there we go. So there is our mining portal. So let's just go. All you need to do is just walk into it and hold shift, obviously. And then that will take you into the mining world. I just wanted to see what this was actually like. So let's just put a little bit of a marker. Oh, I wonder what that was then. It was like a shadow crept across the screen. So let's, that's the uh, portal home. Can we spell? There we go. Good. Right, so that's our marker. And it looks as though it's just been set up. So it's just a nice flat world. And we should be able to get absolutely everything that we need here. I can't see anybody else's portal around here at all so that's making me think that this is probably potentially i'm the only one that's in this world i don't know I, do you know it's been a while since i played it so i'm not really sure how it works but yeah there are some ores on the surface so we've got some certus quartz so we should probably grab that up just in case we are sharing with somebody else we don't want to give stuff away too easily Although we're all a friendly bunch, so if anybody ever needed anything, then obviously we would share. So cool, right, that is portal number one done. And of course the other portal that I want to do today, or have a go at doing today, is the nether portal. Now, yeah, nothing else over there. It's handy that that's just there, because we are going to want to grab some slime pretty quickly. I'm hoping to do that as well today. Oh, it is night time, so let's get inside and sleep. Now, because of the time of day that I'm playing, I'm the only person that's on the server at the moment. And I'm hoping that, that goes really quick. Yes, yeah, so I'm the only person that's on the server. And I'm probably the only person that hasn't had a death yet either. So we need to grab a bunch of obsidian in order to do this. So we're going to have to use some of our diamond supplies and make ourselves... A diamond pick like so and yeah like that good good and we need our tool I think we need the tool maybe we don't need the tool I don't know but we will put some of this stuff away in any case because we have got way 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 too much stuff out now and yeah that'll do and what we are gonna need is to grab ourselves I'm gonna grab I don't need to do it but I'm gonna grab myself a bucket and I'm gonna yeah I'm gonna grab myself a bucket just because that will hopefully make things a bit easier I'm gonna grab some wood because you never know when you're gonna need that either just love those in there for now and just put another few bits and pieces away that we don't need Cool, right, that will do for now. And we are gonna need to go and find some lava. Now, it just so happens that there is some lava just over here. So hopefully we can use that. So if we grab a bucket, let's grab some water out of here and let's go and throw a load of this water down. And I just wanna get myself down here like so so we'll put that on there 
and that will all turn into obsidian and we'll do the same over here let's just get rid of that bit and then we'll turn that into obsidian as well and yeah so i'm just going to gather up a load of this anyway and yeah i'll be back in a minute okay so grabbed a load of obsidian and now we can just quickly grab ourselves a little more of i'm hoping flint and we make ourselves another flint and steel in preparation for this cool cool there we go and just i think want to make some fencing for this and so what am i doing quick quick get it under control relic and is that it no they're gates oh, i can't even remember the recipe for a fence what is life coming to right there we go so there are some fences we'll just grab all of those for now just because i don't know what's in the nether in this pack and we are going to put it directly up against the wall are we no we're not we will put it directly against here so in fact i've now got to take that one up again because i want to do exactly the same so they look coordinated and I want to dig that down into the ground. So one, two, three. I'm using my diamond pick to dig dirt because that is how I roll. Right, so one, and two, three, four. And one, two, three, four, five. And where's our flint and steel? Nice. Right, that is done. And that's before it gets dark, let's quickly get this uh I keep hearing buzzing around me which is a little bit annoying let's quickly get this round here and i did want a fence as well because otherwise i am not actually going to be able to get in this at all let's just get that up again really quickly so let's put this all the way along here and we'll leave a gate there and then we'll put it no, i'm not gonna have enough room Right, we'll sort out the rest of that later. It's going to quickly sleep and I'll grab myself a gate as well. There's a couple of things have spawned in because I wasn't quite quick enough, but we're going to another portal and put the gate there. And let's go and check this out. So here we go and let's see what kind of spawn we get in here. And what on earth? has just happened where am i what am i doing in the middle of the ocean uh well this is somewhat interesting i did quite expect this and there are uh, uh. okay well let's try that again we'll jump in this is clearly somebody else's nether portal I didn't quite expect that to to happen okay so we are back well sort of anyway the nether portals i know now that you need to put on a chest plate of diamond in order to use it and however i didn't do that and before i'd realized my error i'd been transported to another portal that was five thousand blocks away I thought well I'll just jump in it again and eventually it will take me back home and what actually happened was I ended up being transported into a solid wall and I died instantly unfortunately that death occurred 40,000 blocks from home so for the next while I am going to be heading towards that marker over there yeah so we've got 41,000 blocks to go I think this is going to take me some time, especially if I keep running into poison ivy like I just have done. Yeah, so pretty annoying, but unfortunately I can't just leave it because I had all my diamonds on me and I really, really don't want to have to go and mine at that level of diamond again before I can actually use a nether pool. So I will be back in... What for you will be a couple of minutes or even it will be instantaneous, obviously. But for me, it is going to be quite a hike. So I will see you in a while. Okay, so we are back at base. 
And unfortunately, bad news, we're not going to be able to get our stuff back because there is actually a world border set up which you can't get past. And that's about 5,000 blocks or so in. So I had to kill myself, come back home again. And just got to accept the fact that we are going to have to go and do a load more mining before we're able to get through into the nether. But one thing I do want to do for this episode is I want to get... Yeah, maybe. Did I leave my... In fact, we'll do it this way rather than doing it in the overworld. We'll do it in the portal. If I didn't have my portal... In fact... I might not even need it. I think I can just go through this without the the portal device. We can. Good. So we can at least get up here and grab ourselves some slime. And get ourselves a slime sling, which is going to make getting around a little bit easier. So this really wasn't how I expected this episode to go. I thought it's all going to be great. But yeah, unfortunately, Relic Strikes again. And... Yeah, we'll just get ourselves pretty much directly under this and we will just make a big old dirt tower and hopefully we can get some bits and pieces up here. I should have come more prepared to be honest. All I've come with is a shovel and yeah, that is pretty much it. Okay, so cool, we're up here. Um, just grab a couple of bits and pieces of this. And hopefully we can get ourselves a sapling as well. And let's see whether there's one there. And we'll try it and grab. I'd quite like to get a couple more actually just to save on a little bit of time. Now, I don't think for a minute. In fact, yeah, that's fine. And no more saplings. Just how many have I got altogether? Three. Probably we'll just grab the rest of this while we're here to be honest just to make life a little bit easier and yeah one's fell off the edge just fine they shouldn't despawn by the time we get down there and let's grab some of this slimy grass as well so that we can actually is this still does it retain yeah it does cool so we should be able to grow some of this when we're back as well i'm not going to use my shovel because i want to see if that can save me for getting back down again that should be enough for now we know this is here we can get back up here again if we need to but we're going to be able to in fact let's just grab some more of the blue because i've only got a couple of bits of that i should have should have bought a bucket as well that would have made life a little bit easier with the tinkers but yeah fine so we can get back up here if we need to and if that will just let me out of here that would be absolutely great and now, I've got no food, so we need to make this a bit sharpish. We can get ourselves down, get ourselves back into the overworld, and we can press on. That took an absolute age. I don't think I've even got any food in here now, which is a bit hard. We've got some steaks, so we can quickly throw those in there. So not all is lost. Got a little bit of iron, and now I'm hoping that we should be able to make some slime boots and a sling. Something is just slime boots. Is that... M yes, that is. The mod is there. Cool, right. So all we need for that is to turn some of that into slime balls. A couple of bits of that. And there's our boots. And then the actual sling itself. We're going to require some string for that, which I know I've got a couple of pieces of string in here. Good, good. And, yeah, so we need another slime ball as well. As I stand there wondering why it's not auto-crafted for me. Cool. So that is, that is all good. So I can pop that on there. And my googly eyes have disappeared. I don't know why that is. Maybe it's because you only have them when you haven't died. Cool. Right, so we've slept. And as always, just, in fact, let's eat first before we do anything else because... Just because we should. And get our health back up to full again. There we go. So let's just check this out. See if this has been nerfed at all in the pack. Which it hasn't. And yeah. That makes me a happy man. 
getting around is going to be so much quicker now, so much easier. As I say, all is not lost. Good. Okay. So I am going to end the episode there. And I'm not sure, with all the messing around, exactly how long this episode has been now. And I certainly didn't get done all the bits and pieces that I wanted to. I wanted to establish a little bit of a base in the nether. But yeah, we've got a fair bit of mining to go. But we've got access to the mining dimension now, so that should make things a little bit quicker. And that is certainly where I'm going to be spending a lot of my time in between this episode and the next one because we are going to need to replenish our store of diamonds. So yeah, busy, busy, busy. And with that, if you've liked the episode, then obviously drop us a like. Always, always appreciated. And until next time, guys, thanks ever so much for watching. Take care, and I'll see you in the next episode. Bye.